Hey everyone, it's Judy. I'm here because uh, I received a kind of like a happy mail. Um, I had agreed to swap some uh, laces and trims with Deb Hendrick over at Deb Hendrick YouTube. And uh, <laughs> the funny thing is, I just thought she wanted some of my laces, you know, and I don't have a problem with that. So I sent her, I packed up a whole bunch of laces. And before I could even get them mailed, she had, she was uh, feeling ill, but she texted me or messaged me and said, my daughter mailed a package to you. And then later I find out it's colored laces because she doesn't use colored laces. Well, of course, what did I send her? I sent her colored laces, but I also sent her a lot of white and cream. And uh, uh, she said cotton is best for her because of her hands. So, and I didn't know that till it was already packed. So, but I did send her some cotton. So I'm gonna share with you guys what Deb sent me. It is beautiful. And let's see, I tried to make the light as best as I could without it being, because my overhead light is too much light. So sorry if I'm making you dizzy. I want you to be able to see, this is a very light lavender underneath and a white on the top. I hope you can see that because it is beautiful. And there's probably a good yard here. So that's cool. And my mom's favorite color is lavender. So, and then she sent me this real pretty hot pink. So, and I am sure I'm going to be using that very soon on something that I have planned. And then look how wide this is. So you know what this is going to be for? When my girlfriend gets here, she makes American Girl dolls clothes. And I'm going to have her make a couple things out of this for me and my granddaughters because I have uh, three dolls here and I have three or four dolls in New York, American Girls, of my own plus my granddaughters. So she probably sent me, let's see, one... Probably almost two yards of this. Isn't that pretty? Okay, so. And then she did send me some white. So. This, I thought, even on top of that red that I just showed you, would be pretty. This is a nice wide, uh, I'm going to say, three inches wide. So if you take this, let's just see. I'm not very good at this. I, I've been struggling making something that I got a kit for, and I'm just not good at all this layer stuff because my do Wouldn't that be pretty, though? Red and white. And that is actually uh, my, my kids, when they were kids, school colors. So she probably sent me a good two yards of that one, too. And then... Let me get this open. I hope I don't look funky because I'm actually using my computer instead of my tablet. So, I, you know, I've only done that twice before because it never seems to work out. Oh, you like my fingernails? My granddaughter wanted to do my nails. So I let her. Why not? I'll wear it to church tomorrow and then take it off. But it tickles her that I let her do that kind of stuff. So anyway, isn't that a pretty lace? And again, a good two yards. So Deb was more than generous, but look at this peach. I hope you can see that this is peach. It looks pink on there, but it's actually peach. Isn't that pretty? So I think that's going to go in some authentic Easter paper. And then wait till you see this. I have never seen this before. Maybe you guys have. I'm not sure how to use it. Whoops, sorry guys. But that is crocheted. That is, I hope you can see it. That is crocheted. 
And I'm telling you, there's got to be four yards here. One, two, three, four. Oh my gosh, there's five yards there. So I need to figure out how to use this, best way to use it for some of the things we do. And then, last but certainly not least, like I said, Deb was very, very generous, is this other hot pink. And again, it looks red there, I think, but it's really a hot pink. And it's about, I'm gonna say, three quarters of an inch wide. Whoops, I'm showing you the back side. Maybe not. But anyway, isn't that pretty? I don't know if you can see the detail on that. Yeah, there. So anyway, um, so I just want to thank Deb. I hope she got my package, but if not, she should get it by Monday. So, Debbie, thank you, thank you, thank you. Love you, girl. Continue praying for you and your family, because I know you guys have had the flu and you were under the weather and you got things going on. So just want you to know I think about you. And I was thinking about you today when my husband and I were out for a walk. And uh, I just want you to know I love you, girl. Thank you so much for your generosity. God bless you guys. Have a great day. I always do it.